ये अपना लॉन्गर वीडियो अच्छा चल रहा है यूट्यूब का वो कुछ एक वीडियो है ना अपना बीस मिनट का कुछ हाँ वही जिसमें सोलह क्वेश्चन है दैट इज एक्चुअली गोइंग गुड मैन आई रिकॉर्डेड आई थॉट के बीस मिनट का शायद नहीं चलेगा बट इट्स एक्चुअली गोइंग गुड डू यू नो एनी रीजन क्या है I guess there is some audience retention fund uh, which I need to explain. Maybe it's working for you guys, maybe it's working for others, mm-hmm. but it's definitely working for us. तेरे को पता है audience retention और ये सब? नहीं नहीं। आपको मालूम है guys? Hello and welcome to this another episode and did you perform guys way today we're going to be talking about the importance of a longer piece of content or longer form of videos on YouTube platform now why this is important this is important because if you have longer content people would tend to watch it a little bit more as compared to your shorter videos i'll explain you how let's suppose if you have a 2 minute video people might and and let's suppose if on that 2 minute video you have uh, let's say 100 views now out of that 100 views maybe just to take an example maybe only 30 people would be watching the complete 2 minute video what about the remaining ones all right they might just watch it after uh, they, they might just drop it after 30 seconds or maybe 20 seconds or maybe 50 seconds or maybe just uh, one and a half minutes right so the average audience retention for that 2 minute video would be somewhere around uh, maybe 40 seconds all right on an average or maybe 30 seconds on an average and that would impact and go into your complete youtube channel's audience retention ratio but now as compared to that if you have more longer form of content but now make sure you don't have to just keep it long 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 just like that you have to be meaningful you have to be valuable your content should be providing value and it should be attractive enough people should be sticking to your content things like that so let's suppose if you have a longer form of content let's say 20 minutes or maybe 1 hour long video all right and if you do that consistently providing value then in 1 hour long video maybe out of 100 views 30 or 40 people might be uh, watching it till maybe uh, 50 sec- 50 minutes a uh, couple of them might just drop off after 30 minutes something like that but now on an average the audience retention for that particular piece of content would be around 20 to 25 minutes all right i'm, I'm just randomly picking up the numbers just to give you an idea so now that 25 minutes audience retention time period would add up to the entire youtube channel your youtube channel's audience retention ratio and that would drastically increase your audience retention now just because this audience retention or watch time ratio would increase on your channel that would have a huge impact on youtube seo and your video would be uh, treated as valuable piece of content so youtube would rank your videos for a set, uh, particular set of keywords which you are targeting so now let's just see and uh, let's look into the practical demonstration of what we are talking about over here now i'm going to give you two examples one is this particular video which is on 16 unique digital marketing interview questions uh, which we did 2 months ago and this is like on a keyword digital marketing interview questions if somebody is searching for this this video is ranking on the top now i don't know when you are watching this particular video but when i'm recording this it is uh, 14th of feb but wait it's valentines happy valentines <laughs> so uh, on this 14th feb 2018 i'm recording and uh, screen casting this uh, video so at that point in time this is number 1 position so for this keyword let's say if we remove this interview and if we just keep digital marketing questions probably yes still it is ranking so all for for all of these keywords it is ranking over here now just because it is valuable piece of information it is like 22 minutes long right and it is 22 minutes long people are liking it and if i tell you the youtube analytics for this particular video the average view duration is 5 minutes and 22 seconds out of the number of views which we got uh, which is uh, just give me a second while i just act. this this would be like uh, the this would not be the updated version to see the updated number of views just view that video once and you would be able to see the number of views so right now we have 2368 views and we have got a lot of comments over here people are finding this valuable people who are watching it completely so probably 30 somewhere around 30 uh, comments we have on this yeah we have 35 comments all right so a uh, 2000 plus 2300 plus views we have already got for this video and people are liking it so the audience retention for that particular video if we talk about this in the lifetime span so this was being shot on december 6th till february 12 uh, 2018 is average duration is 5 minutes and 22 seconds 
So just because it was longer form of content, it is having longer audience retention. And look at this, just because it is valuable, it is like above average, all right? Uh, between above average and average is the relative audience retention. Now, what is relative audience retention? The absolute audience retention is something different. Relative audience retention is something which you should be focusing upon. The relative audience retention shows your video's ability to retain viewers during the playback by comparing it to all YouTube videos of similar length, all right? So this basically YouTube in its algorithm compares your piece of content with similar content of similar length on YouTube platform. So in a way you can think like this video piece of content, which is yours, would be now compared by Google's or YouTube's algorithm with its own competitor within the algorithm, all right? You can just, in layman terms, you can think like this. So this is where the funda lies. So the more you have average view duration, the more it is having larger retention and, and it is indirectly affecting YouTube SEO. You will definitely have good rankings. Another one which I'll tell you is for a keyword, which is Shopify help. Now, uh, earlier one before we jump into this, this digital marketing interview question, which is something which we targeted was, uh, is, is being searched by 3,600 people on an average in one single month. All right. And this is being ranked on top in just two months. Second one is, and this is pure organic, all right? This is pure organic. These number of views are pure organic. Number two is Shopify help keyword, which is being searched by 6,600 uh, 6, times on an average uh, in one single month. And this is having somewhere around, uh, I suppose it might be having 9,500 views, if I'm not mistaken, 9,300 views, all right? As per the recent update. And this is like as long as one hour and 43 minutes. All right, this is like 90 plus minutes of content and this is super powerful right now over here and check this out, the audience retention and this was being recorded on September 9th, 2017 till February 12, 2018, uh, lifetime right now. Uh, the average view duration is 13 minutes and 31 seconds. All right, 13 minutes and 31 seconds, not bad enough. And the important part, more than this, all right, more than this, the important part is this one, the relative audience retention, which I talked about YouTube's algorithm, comparing it with similar content, similar length videos. Look at this, the curve, it is like above average. Most of the times above average over here, and it is consistent, all right, for this much long of a time. And that's the reason why this content is super powerful as compared to the similar videos of similar niche. So this is what uh, we are trying to explain you in this particular video at Did You Perform that try to prepare uh, valuable information and try to keep it a little bit long. Maybe 10 minutes would be uh, fine enough. At times you can go 20 minutes, at times you can go one hour, but on an average your YouTube's, uh, what you say, the video length of your complete YouTube channel should be somewhere around 10 minutes and it would definitely give you a boost. So at times you can just do a two minute video, at times 10 minutes, at times 20 minutes, but make sure whatever you do, don't try to push yourself just to increase the video length. Try to push yourself in a way where you are standing out from the crowd to provide value to your audience. All right. Always deliver value. All right. Deliver value. So that's it for this particular episode, guys. Uh, I look forward to see you in the next one. Till then, take care, bye guys. And as always, guys, stay awesome. God bless. And if you haven't, then subscribe. <laughs> What are you doing? I don't know. 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 I don't know